What's going on, internet? Brandon and Covey. Hello. Nerdlocker.com. Yes. This is Marvel Entertainment News. And uh, what are you drinking? People have asked what we've been drinking. Uh, tonight I am drinking a little bit of uh, Red Breast 12 Year. Mm. It's a single uh, pot Irish whiskey. And I am drinking a Brooklyn Summer Ale. Yeah. We're, we've tried to ask for sponsorship through every other company, so now we're hitting you up, alcohol companies. Yes, like it's, us. A, like, it's a lot of mm. money to be uh, had. Mm. Either way, let's get into Marvel Entertainment News. Uh, Brian Singer, and you just gonna come in while we're filming, buddy? Just what happens when dogs run the house. Um, Brian Singer was on Instagram and took a picture of just the first. Just joined Instagram. Oh, just recently. Yes. Um, I did not realize that. Um, this is his first oh. picture. Well, it's a picture it of the... Right script. Yeah, that word. Like the first page of the script for X-Men Apocalypse. You kind of see a few things dealing with in the first paragraph, but it's things that we've seen already in the uh, Sting trailer teaser thing at the end of Days of Future Past. It's just uh, it just a basically, it's say, talking about a war scene going on with the Horsemen of the Apocalypse there. The Four Horsemen. Holy crap. Cannot wait. It's going to start out in the past. It's going to be so sweet. I'm just waiting for, like, young early X-Men team. Yeah. Let's do this. I want a young Scott. I want, I want a young, young Gene. Gene. But like, I want Gene to also be able to atomize a planet. So I don't know how that's they're gonna do that. That's down the line, though. That's... Yeah, but that's what I want now. Gene's not that cool. Other than that, she's really hot. Other than that, there's nothing else to her. Well, at least she'll have that. Yeah, but like, do you think Scott will have a I'm... backbone, or will it be like? I know my girl can do more. He'll be like unbackbone Scott. No, he'll be like completely obsessed with Gene, and he'll like let that get in the way. But then he'll come up at the end of the day, do what he needs to do. Get the girl. Wolverine will be pissed. He'll be staring at the picture. Well, that won't make sense because Wolverine's like... Oh, he's not there right now. Yeah, that's right. Well, no, he's going to be in it, they said, but he's like... He's going to be like Weapon X. Like, that's the whole time frame of this whole thing is like Weapon X days. Let's see what they do. Yeah. I, I'm excited for the 80s feel of the movie. I'm going to be honest. That's, that's it. Uh, giant Guardians of the Galaxy news. Uh, Michael Rooker. You know him? Rooker. Rooker from uh, Walking Dead. Uh, Merle. Um, he is in Guardians of the Galaxy yes. as Yondu. Uh, James Gunn teased a picture of like the silhouette of him, but if you just go on Google and Google Yondu, you can see him in full makeup. He looks pretty cool. Um, uh, yeah, I thought we saw him already. Like I don't remember ago. like looking into it, but I when I Either Google way. the name, I'm like, oh. I'm just excited for everything about this movie. I, it looks great. Uh, there's a lot of news coming out this week about it. Um, Biggest one I saw was that uh, originally, you know, we've heard talks of another Hulk movie and then like a Planet Hulk movie. Um, they're not necessarily saying that, but there's a chance at the end of Age of Ultron, you will see Bruce Banner going into space to join the Guardians. Now, he's never been on the team in the comic as far as I know, um, but I mean, I feel like you can utilize him. Yeah. I think be fine. I just feel like they're going to use Thanos to kill the Hulk. And then he'll, they'll come back, and that'll be Avengers 3. We'll be like, the Guardian's showing up with the dead Bruce Banner. Or oh, dead Hulk. Check it out. And they're like, no. He's, he didn't change he's, back. He is heavy as hell. He's coming. And then they all die or something, and Thanos shows up at the end of Guardians, and that's Avengers 3. And they're like, we just beat up Ultron. Oh, my God. Now we got to fight Thanos. Check it out. Here he is. Um, know. That's my speculation, though. I, don't, I, I think that'd be good, though. I mean, I, I want to see more Hulk. I think he did an awesome job as Bruce Banner and uh, just as Hulk in general. And I, I hope he's utilized more. I know he's getting used more in this movie. In other news, um, I don't remember if we read it over here or not, but uh, Andy Serkis has been doing a lot of motion capture with Mark Ruffalo. He's been working closely with Mark Ruffalo on Avengers 2. He is, they haven't confirmed he has a role, but he's not doing Hulk stuff. He is doing a different character with him. She-Hulk. <laughs> Actually, I'm sure he would make an awesome motion capture. He'd probably make an awesome motion capture <laughs> She-Hulk, but it'd really kill like 90% of my boners during that movie. So... What if they just like, whose face would they put over... Jen Walters. No, whose face? Jen Walters? Just Jennifer Jen Walters. Walters. I'm, I'm pretty sure there's at least 40 Jennifer Walters in the world that are pretty good to look at. And, if uh, you're everyone not else. Jennifer Walter, 
let him know. Yeah. So he can make this sheet. We're gonna. If you went, if you went to UCLA, circus's body. UCLA Law School. Um, what else? Um, fought crime Maybe and ripped apart the vision. Send me a picture of you because you just might be in my Avengers movie. You got a bad with Andy She-Hulk Circus. In it. No, with She Hulk in it. It's my Avengers movie with She Hulk. But Andy Circus is the body of She Hulk. Mm, just the, the acting motion, of it. The acting of just it. Just the acting of it. But uh. But I'm saying it's mine. I'm not saying Avengers. I'm saying my movie. Um. Because I'm devious. You don't want to get copyright infringement. No. Haven't you seen Avengers Triple X? You don't need that. That's a thing. Yeah, you haven't seen it? Did not know that. Scarlet Witch and the Hulk totally bang. It's really Stop weird. It. Scarlet Witch? No, no, no. Uh, Black Widow. <laughs> like, wait, what? Black Widow, but I think Scarlet well, Witch is in it, too. They're talking about they might bang in this movie, Avengers 2. So now can they sue the Avengers for taking their idea? Uh, I think so. Like, hey, we already did that. Joss Whedon. We already did Joss that. Joss Whedon. Or Joss Whedon was watching This it? lady had to wipe green off her inside oh, of her oh, mouth. Oh, wow. Come on. Yeah, his, everything's <laughs> yes. green, dude. Come on. Everything's green. Everything's green. Um, in less whatever news that was. It's green except for like the crease where your legs meet. Oh my god. You know? Like that crease and like <laughs> the butt crease is the same thing. It's not exactly fully green. What kind of makeup really guy weird. doesn't go the I don't know. yard on this? I don't know. I think you need to put like like polyurethane. To ruin to ruin your it, you know? whole thing you were just talking about? I know China was the she hulk in a she hulk. Oh, that was Yeah, no, I didn't watch that one. Because it would just China. destroy you? Exactly. It's terrible. It's the worst thing ever. <laughs> I want She-Hulk to still have a body on her. Come on, man. But it's trying to but do But that's the thing. It's a comic book. So you can draw like this giant, big, huge, like muscular woman and have her be like sexy we in a comic book. But, but hold on. No, I'm getting, I'm going to make an awesome point. All you right. can do that in a comic book and it'd be like, man, that's, that's a pretty good figure. I like the way that artist did that. That's not that creepy. But then you have like... <laughs> China do it, and it just looks like uh, that scene in Avengers Disassembled where she freaks out on the vision, <laughs> like ah! and rips the vision apart, but where her like face goes from being everything so like, to like big. she has like that the is neck that of, is the worst I've ever seen. Yeah. She Hulk, I'm just, I'm yeah, she looks like the going, mountain, the like she turns into the mountain and then rips vision apart. We just find out he's just 25. That's insane. Six. He's he 26. Looks like he's like. Yeah, he looks, he looks like, like he's, he's like 36. Late 30s. And he can rip your face off. Dude, he would beat the crap out of all Crush your that. face in. All right, back on topic here. Uh, I don't want to talk about that. Um, Eldon Henson, uh, who I had to be reminded of, was in Mighty Ducks as a kid. He got cast as Foggy Nelson. That's pretty sweet. And that's awesome. That he's also been awesome. in other things, but uh, Mighty Ducks. He was in Castaway. He was in Castaway. I don't remember where. Uh, Deja Vu. Jobs. I'm just reading his list right here. I, I didn't see, see Jobs. Um, I heard it was bad. Either way, Foggy Nelson. This is uh, so far looking to be really awesome. I like all the casting choices on this. Gomer Pyle is freaking the kingpin. Vincent Rosario Dawson, Dawson as anything. I'm wondering who she's gonna be. I think Night Nurse, not Electra. I, I, I don't think. I don't think Electra. No. I just hope that they do. Do you think do, they'll include Electra? I hope that they do Bullseye at some point, but not. Trench coat. Trench coat. Like, I want I like a bull. No, I want a I feel like costume. they wouldn't do it, but I think a bullseye costume would be really awesome. You know what? Marvel's done a great job with the costumes and not compromising. The Daredevil one is going to be very, 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 very important. It is. Very important. It is. They have to get it right. I it's really not have. armor. It's not Batman. He's not a billionaire. No. Tony Stark only... doesn't help him. He's a lawyer, which means he's a millionaire. But well, still. no, I think, no, he, I think he's, he's got like a, a lot of student loans and he's stuff. He's like a pro bono dude. Yeah, he he's does like, a lot of free stuff. He works for Hell's Kitchen. He's like a superhero. Mm. Yeah. He's trying to get that advertisement again. Um, so you have to. You're not selling it. You're you're forcing it. You're gonna be cool. So you just do this. Yeah, but we need the bottle here. It's delicious. Like Kiefer Sutherland. I think that's against the FCC regulations, but I'm not sure. Okay, because he's an alcoholic. Oh, yeah. So yeah why an alcoholic is he... doing a commercial for Apparently, uh, someone's on a wagon. Right? He's like, hey guys, want some tequila? That's, that's what is happening right there. That is what's <laughs> happening. He has a problem. Um, speaking of problems, uh, they announced that the new Fantastic Four movie is going to have a found footage feel to it. You got, you got to expect this when you're getting Josh Trank to do your movie. That was the whole thing that made Chronicle like really awesome and really interesting. Uh, I'm, I'm not excited. I I've never been excited for this happen. movie. I want them 
to do all the terrible things in this movie so it sucks and no one sees it and then Marvel can get it back and we can have the thing fighting the Hulk or you know, Reed Richards and Tony Stark hanging out. Or Johnny Storm, Iceman, and uh, Spider-Man all being the best of friends. Yes, I want everything back at Marvel. That's what I want. That could be a, that could be the greatest... Buddy movie Nick, ever. No, no, not movie. Nick Jr. TV show ever. Or Disney Channel show ever. It would definitely be Disney Channel at this point. Yeah, well, no, but I'm just saying... No, what did I say Nick Jr.? You just said Nick I meant, Jr. I meant Disney Jr. Kids, whatever, their version With of that. With all of them hanging out. Yeah, just like a little kid's oh, version of that. Hanging, Nick Jr. Now. hanging out. Yeah, yeah I don't face. know why I said Nick Jr. Remember face, face? Face was annoying. Face was annoying. You just said that because you were you were you were all like, oh, you remember Face? And then I said Face was annoying to get you to be like Face was annoying because I knew annoying. you would you would have flip flop on that. I would have flip flop. He wasn't annoying. Face was, face was annoying as shit. Or it wasn't. Who else was annoying? The Frog on Gully Gully Island. I didn't watch that, but uh, Steve. Did you beat it's pretty pretty bad. Steve and, was pretty uh, bad. Uh, Dora. I didn't. I was past Dora. No, not even Dora. You know who was really annoying? Swiper. Because you keep telling him not to swipe, and he show up. Were you the kid that talked back to the TV? Well, no, no. Like, but you're like swiper, no swiping. Dude, that came out when we swiper, were in like no middle school. Yeah, and guess what? I had oh, a brother and, okay. and a sister all right, all right. and cousins. That makes sense. So Never mind. yes, completely validated. I had to babysit a lot. Uh, either way, that is our Marvel Entertainment News slash Nick Jr. reminiscent news and uh, everything else. So uh, let us know what you guys think in the comments below about what we talked about. And uh, we'll be back next week with even more Marvel Entertainment News.